welcome to Colchester. Welcome to your new home. My name's Will Parrick and I'm a housing trainee for Colchester Borough Homes. Like you, I'm fairly new to CBH, so why don't we go together and find out a bit about them. Your property is owned by Colchester Borough Council, but it's managed by Colchester Borough Homes. Colchester Borough Homes are an arm's length management organisation, or ALMO, and their main purpose is to manage the council's stock of properties. Colchester Borough Homes manages over 6,000 properties across the borough. Our areas include Tiptree, Mersey, Dedham and Chapel, as well as right here in the town centre. We want you to enjoy living in your home, and we hope that this short film will help you do so. At the start of your tenancy, you'll be provided with this tenant's handbook. This lays out your responsibility as a tenant and our responsibilities to you. Keep hold of this guide because it should answer most of your initial queries. Your house will be provided to you in a clean and tidy state, but it may need some decorating. In those circumstances, we provide you with decorating vouchers, although these do need to be used within three months of you moving in. Also, you will be responsible for having your gas and electricity connected. You can choose your own energy supplier, but we work in partnership with Ebico, who may be able to offer you a fairer deal, particularly on prepayment meters. You are responsible for ensuring the contents of your home. We recommend a low cost scheme, details of which are available through Colchester Borough Homes. Your tenant's guide will set out your repair responsibilities. Please read section 5 before you contact our repairs department. There are, however, some repairs that are our responsibility. And if this is the case, contact us by free phone or report your repair online, details of which will be available at the end of this film. Our repairs centre is based at Gosbecks Road in Colchester. They are open for telephone calls from 8.30am till 5.30pm, but emergency calls can be taken 24 hours a day. Again, your tenant's guide will tell you what an emergency repair is. Your repair will be handled by a member of our repairs team. Do not let anyone enter your home without checking their identity. All of our staff carry photo ID cards. You must ask to see this card. If you are in any doubt, ring us up to check. If you have gas in your home, you must allow us access once a year to service your gas appliances. Everyone has the right to enjoy their neighbourhood. Being a good neighbour can go a long way to help achieving this. Please respect your neighbours and respect their lifestyle. If, however, nuisance is caused by other people's behaviour, there are some positive steps that you can take. Firstly, try talking to your neighbour, because they may not realise that they're causing a nuisance at all. If this doesn't work, then we can recommend a mediation service. Car parking can often cause problems between neighbours. If you have a car, please park it considerately. If it is a case of serious antisocial behaviour, such as hate crime, drug dealing or threatening behaviour, then you can contact our tenancy enforcement team by free phone. They will offer you help, advice and support. Your rent is due one week in advance on a Monday. We have lots of payment methods available to you. If you have a bank account, then direct debit may be the easiest way to pay. But don't worry if you don't have a bank account, 
ask for a payment card that will enable you to pay at a post office or payment slips to pay at the bank. Please allow three extra days for the rent to get into your account if you pay at a bank or post office. Other ways to pay include text payments and online payments. Please just ask about the options so that we can find one that suits you. But remember, your rent must be paid in advance. There are many ways that you can get involved with your community to make a real difference to your neighbourhood. There may be a, a residence association or local tenants group, or maybe a group for parents with young children. We work very closely with such organisations covering all aspects of your community. So why not try getting involved? Our staff are on hand to help you and give advice. Our customer services call centre is based at our Greenstead housing office. You can telephone them for free or you can drop in and see them. Most new tenants are introductory tenants for 12 months. This means that your tenancy will not be secure until you have successfully completed 12 months in your home. You must keep a clear rent account and must not breach any tenancy conditions. You have a responsibility to keep your home clean and tidy and to maintain your garden if you have one. If you are moving into a flat, make sure you know if you have your own garden to maintain. If you wish to keep a pet, you must get permission from your housing officer. Do not make any alterations to your property whilst you are an introductory tenant. When you become a secure tenant, you must ask permission for any alterations. If this is your first home or you require assistance to maintain your tenancy, we may be able to offer you extra support through one of our partner agencies, such as Floating Support, Open Road, CAB or the Youth Inquiry Service. Contact us if you think you can benefit from this extra support. Once you have settled in, your housing officer will visit you at home. They will want to know how things are going, so please make sure you don't miss this important opportunity to talk about your tenancy. You will also be invited to a new tenants workshop. This is one of the ways that you can get involved in decisions that affect the management of your home. We have a team of staff dedicated to making sure that tenants have the opportunity to make their views heard. They arrange meetings, conferences and other information events to help you make the most of your tenancy. Full details of activities will be sent to you three times a year in your housing news and views. Try very hard to get things right for our customers, but occasionally you may feel that you need to complain about something. We have a complaints procedure and any complaints will be thoroughly investigated. You may write, email or telephone your complaint. Now that we have reached the end of our journey, I hope, like me, you have learnt a lot about Colchester Borough Homes. Remember, our staff are on hand to help. Whatever your query, feel free to contact us. If you do experience difficulties at any stage of your tenancy, contact us sooner rather than later and we will do our best to help. Thanks for watching and I hope that you enjoy living in a home that is managed by Colchester Borough Homes.